I'm gonna be fishing from right over there this morning. Right down here, there's two big snook. Right there in that shadow, there's three really big snook cruising the edge of that shadow right there this morning. I'm gonna be chunking a irresistible topwater. There's four of them down there. I don't know if you can see them, but they are monsters. I hope we get hooked up this morning. I haven't rigged up yet, but this is what I'm going to start out throwing this morning. It's a broken back rebel. It's one of my favorite lures for catching snook along the shadow like this. And uh, I'm going to put on some 50 pound mono because those are big snook hanging out down there. I'm not going to fish for very long this morning. My, uh, my church is doing a thing where they, they get groceries for pennies on the dollar from the food bank. And, uh, We'll be having a big outreach. Last time we had an outreach, fed over 600 people. And uh, this morning we have three tons of food that are being delivered to the truck. And I got to head out of here in a little while and go down there and help. I got to be there by 10 o'clock. So anyway, I'm going to stop talking here in a minute. And I'm going to go fishing. So that's what that lure looks like that I'm throwing right there. Silver with a little bit of a blue back on it. Oh, those are some big snook laying over there. Brought my big snook rod today. I got my drag tightened down good. I got 30 pound test on here. 50 pound monofilament leader. All right, here we go. Give it a whirl. The tide's moving really good, so I want to cast out away from where that shadow is. And the idea, they're laying right on the edge of that shadow. I want to run this bait. I want to run it right along the edge of the shadow. Tide's not moving real fast. I'm uh, definitely able to get out in the strike zone. Oh man. Oh my God, one just followed it all the way up. Oh, there he is. There he is. Got him. <sighs> so this is the snook zone. You see that light pole right there? What's happening at night is it's throwing light down on the water and the bridge is creating a shadow right along that yellow line that I'm calling the snook zone. Now the tide is going in the direction where it's going back underneath the bridge. And what happens is the snook lay right along that yellow line where the shadow edge is and they kind of lay back in back underneath the bridge as well but all in that area and they'll just cruise back and forth along that shadow facing into the tide waiting for the bait to come floating through to them. And so what you want to do is you want to cast your lure Obviously, you know, as far as you can, pass the snook and away from the shadow line and then let that current just kind of pull it back towards the shadow. And then you want to reel that thing as fast as you can reel it right along that shadow edge or, you know, just back up in the shadow a little bit. You, you're trying to get a reaction strike from them, so you want that lure to just come buzzing by them so that they don't even have a, a second to think whether it's real or not. They just react when they see it. And so that's what's happening here. You can also fish for snook this way with shrimp. Uh, just cast the shrimp way out there, you know, the, the same way, and just let the shrimp drift back in to that shadow as well. <sighs> Very nice. Big fish. Big fish. Get a measurement on this little guy here. 
24 inches. Yeah, here's a good one. See you later, guy. All right, so my kids have been talking about this place forever, telling me it's really good. We're going into the 5 donut shop here. Hey, what's your name? Sierra. Hey, Sierra. Um, so I hear you have amazing glazed donuts. Look at all those donuts. Mmm, you guys made all these this morning, right? Oh, it smells like donuts in here. $8. What's that for? Blue light special? Kmart? Let's check these bad boys out. Ooh, look at that. Oh my gosh. Everything that people have said. I mean, you know, that's not a bad deal. Get up at uh, 6 o'clock hit the water by about 6.30 to go fishing, and uh, next thing you know, you're home by 7.30 with donuts. Dustin. I'm a musician, he always hides behind my stuff. Dustin, good morning. Hi, baby, hi. Hi, what are you doing? Uh-oh, see, he's on, he's on lizard patrol now. He's like, ah, there's gotta be some lizards out here. It's too early in the morning, buddy. Uh-oh, there he goes, he's off. In the house, come on, pretty boy. Boy, he's such a cutie. So this is all food, groceries, gonna be given away at our church on September the 3rd. Families will come here and it will be a no questions asked event. People will just get in line and be able to come through, get whatever groceries they they want. We've got more in here. Behind the sofa, bring those in. We're gonna put those in there. I'm gonna go ahead, bring any of those in you got. I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the air. How about if we get all the cereal over here? Hey guys, that ends another fun day of fishing. Please like this video and subscribe. And remember, don't just sit there. Get off that couch and go fishing. See ya.